Hello and welcome. Try this problem on your own and then press play when you're ready to work on it with me. Okay, I'm going to ask these below graph the inequality 2x plus y is greater than 1. So my first strategy when graphing almost all of these types of linear functions is, or linear inequalities in this case is to write it in what's called mx plus b format. So I want to isolate y and then set it equal to or in this case greater than the slope m times x plus b the intercept. Then I can graph it quickly. So I'm going to isolate y. I'm going to do that by subtracting 2x from both sides. And then I'm, I know that y is greater than 1 minus 2x. So this is like mx plus b form. It's just written where y is greater than b minus mx. Same idea. We're just subtracting. I'm using the greater than sign. So b is our intercept. That's just 1 here. And our slope's negative 2. So that means if I go up twice on the rise, I go back once on the run. Right? Our slope is looking something like this. I can continue it down here. Right? Sometimes you think the slope is going down twice on the rise and up one on the, on the run. Same idea, different direction. Right? Now, if I was graphing the line y equals 1 minus 2x, I would just draw a line right here. But I'm graphing an inequality. And y is not equal to 1 minus 2x. It's everything above the line. 1 minus 2x. So I draw an arrow, dashes. You draw dashes here because it doesn't include the line. You would draw a solid line if it was y is greater than or equal to 1 minus 2x. Then we just shade everything above the line. And I'll just switch colors for that because it's all of the heights above this line. Shade it up. And we shade below it if it was less than, right? And again, we change the line to a solid line when it's less than or equal to or greater than or equal to. All right, I hope this helped.